Doing a cool trick like this is every bit as fun as it looks, but once a skating trick is over, it can be re-experienced. Unless you've got a setup like this. Hi, I'm Sebastian from the Exertion Games Lab at RMIT University. This system is called Copy Paste Skate, and I'll run through how it works. Copy Paste Skate is an interactive feedback system for skateboarders, which lets them re-experience a trick they've just performed. It uses a number of separate components to capture the exact movements and sounds made by a skateboard during a trick, and then replace these for the skater to look at and listen to. So what are the components of this system? Let's check them out, one by one. First up, there's a digital SLR camera that's had its infrared filter removed and a daylight filter put in. Then, there are two infrared lights attached to the skater's board, a directional microphone, two computers, two projectors, and a low-frequency audio transducer attached to the floor. Now that you've seen the bits and pieces that make up copy-paste skate, let's look at how the whole system works. As the skater starts their trick, I trigger the camera to take a shot. It uses a long exposure time of two and a half seconds to take a single photo, and it captures the light being emitted from the board, which, because it's infrared, is invisible to the naked eye. At the same time, the microphone records the sound of the trick and sends it to the laptop, which identifies the audio peaks. And two seconds after the skater lands, the replay starts. The life-size visualization of the trick is projected onto the wall behind the skater, which looks just like light graffiti, but which shows the exact movement of the board. And sound of the trick is being played at half speed. While the audio transducer is put to use as well, it emits powerful low-frequency vibrations that cause the floor of the skating area to vibrate exactly when the audio peaked. By watching, listening to, and feeling these things, the skater can re-experience the trick they've just completed and examine certain aspects of it. Like how long they stayed in the air and how hard and how clean their landing was. Right now, the system is designed for use in a small area by one skater at a time, but I've got big plans for it in the future. Upscaled versions of copy-paste skate could cover large parts of skate parks and let groups of skaters re-experience whole sequences of tricks together. In the meantime, by replaying moments like this, and like this, this system is adding a fresh new dimension to the skateboarding experience.